What's going on guys? Back at it again with another episode here on the channel for Until Dawn. This is a game again, I'll say it again, like I really enjoyed this game the very first time I played it through and I liked it so much as a matter of fact that I wanted to play it here for the channel but just so you guys know, I don't really remember everything about this game but I do know all the big major plot points obviously because I did go through the entire game but I don't remember everything because it was a couple of years now that it has been since I played this game before. So it should be pretty interesting. Hopefully we discover some brand new things in this playthrough. But I am playing this as if it is or was my first time playing. Trying to remember all of the initial, uh, I guess, uh, options that I chose the very first time I played it. But of course I'm going to be missing some along the way. So with that being said, do me a huge favor. Drop a like on the video if you're excited for this video. And if you're not already subscribed, please do that because it really does help this channel grow. So with that being said, let's go ahead and get started with this video. All right, so what do we got going on here? Uh, well, let's go with you. You doing all right? Hey, you doing all right? I mean, I know it must be really tough without your sister. Stop. I just meant that. No, I know what you meant. You know, seriously, I'm over it. And I just I want us to have a good time, you know, like we always used to. It's still weird that we're up here. Damn it. Freaking thing. It's iced. What else? Maybe there's another way in. There are a million ways in. They're just all locked. There's gotta be like a window around the corner we can get like, get open or something. Wait a second. Are you saying we should break in? <laughs> I don't think it's technically breaking in if you own the place, right? Hey, not if I don't report you. <laughs> uh, <laughs> lead the way, coaches. That's such a weird thing. It really isn't breaking in when you own the damn place. Hey, Ash. Hi, Chris. Uh oh, lovebirds. Uh, nice being back. So, how are you doing? Mm, good, but a little cold. I think I could use some time curled up by the fire. Yeah, that does sound pretty nice. That's it. That's the whole conversation. All right then. He's not much of a flirter, is he? Ashley was looking pretty hot today, right? If you say so. She's like a sleeper hit kind of gal, you know? Now I just want to rip that parka right off of her and make some snow angels, right? Uh, cut it out, dude. Hey, cut it out, man. Yeah, I mean, if you're not gonna bang her, maybe. Michael, take up the case. Wait, will you back off on Relax. Already? Just checking to see if there's some blood flowing down there. <laughs> yeah. Listen, dude, look around you. Look at these beautiful mountains. Do you see any parents? I mean, can you imagine a more perfect, ripe scenario just dripping with erotic possibilities? You and Ashley alone at last. You He's such a perv. You've been a perfect gentleman. Now, you come in for the kill. Uh, maybe not in that way, but... I don't know, man. How can you not know? But what if it's, like, weird? And what if she... She might, like, want to be friends with me anymore if I try something like that. I mean, weren't you just listening? You gotta buck up, bro. Grow a pair. It's a little disrespectful how he's talking. Especially about a girl that Chris well, likes. I'm planning on breaking into my parents' lodge, bud. Break a window? I didn't say I had a plan. You sounded like you had a plan. You better deliver, Koshis, or else you got four lovely ladies who are going to be freezing their buns off. And last time I checked, that's not a good way to get laid. Oh, shoot. Maybe that's what not my goal. Buns? What is this? Hmm. Hey, where's the axe? It's like someone came here before us and stole the axe. Saw another shiny well, over well, here. Well, we got ourselves a thinker. Nice one. Oh, I thought this was a uh, one of those electrical boxes. Let's go, Chris. Use those legs. After you, or after me? Alrighty then. Let's go ahead. <laughs> Ow, that looked like it hurt. Oh, I'm okay. 
<laughs> Paid more attention in climbing class. You mean Jim? Yeah, you know, with the climbing up the rope. Whoa, Whoa that's weird. Did I do that? I, I don't think so. Here, use this. It's already starting to get creepy, ain't it? Oh, I think I see a totem right there on the floor. Whoa, Chris, maybe. I just got an awesome idea. Yeah? Totally. What, what is it? Okay, so I'm pretty sure that I've got some deodorant in one of the bathrooms. You could use that with the lighter. I, I don't follow. How's, it, how's a stick of deodorant gonna help? Spray on. It's a can. Oh, yeah. Now I gotcha. Flame Combustible. Throw. Yep. Just like we did with the little army dudes. Yep. Ones we melted. Just point the spray can in the lighter and whoosh. Bye bye, frozen lock. That's Bingo. dangerous, though. All right, so you got this. I'm gonna go sort something out. You up for hunting around in the dark for a little bit? Nope, but I'll do it. Godspeed, Pilgrim. <laughs> <laughs> oh, these guys are retarded, dude. In a good way. They're all funny. Yep, I did. All right, there's a totem right here. What is this, yellow? I think so. Well, looks like she can die. Dun dun dun. Oh snap. Let's explore a little bit. What's over here? Nothing. Hello. Oh wait, hold on. I think there was another area I could have explored. Let's go ahead and take a look first before anything. I like these drawers and stuff. What's this? L... What does that say? Oh. Ex-janitor convicted for arson. Swears revenge on movie mongols family. I'm assuming that, uh, what's his name? Remy Malik's character is the movie guru. No, go this way. What's his name? What's his character's name? I forget. Let's go. Let's see what we find over here. Oh, look, it's a picture. Oh, look, it's a twin. It's a sister's. That's sad. I wonder why the parents are not here. <gasps> Creepy. What the hell was that? It's called the door closing, Chris. Thought you would have known that already. All right, where's down here? Is this the front door? It is, but I think we need the spray can, right? There goes my boo. Hi, Chris. Very funny. Oh, how'd you know it was me? <laughs> Shouldn't you be, like, getting the lock open or something? On it. On it. No, oh, turn around, Chris. There you go. Come on, walk faster, Chris. I wish you could run in this game. Did someone just break a freaking window? All right, what we got going on? A lot of this is really creepy. No, let me through. All right, I think we're supposed to go upstairs though. So let's go ahead and do that. Oh wait, let's go around the back. Ah, turn. The controls are a little weird. It takes a second to get used to, but once you get used to it, it's, it's pretty good. Should I go down there? Oh wait, I guess it's nothing. Dun dun dun. All right, I don't see nothing. So let's go ahead and go over here. Honestly, what is that sound? It's so creepy. 
What do we got here? This is locked too? It legit sounds like someone's upstairs getting laid or something. But of course, it's most likely just the wind. Oh no, it's that window. Let's go around here. See if we find anything interesting. Just laying around, waiting for me to pick up and explore. And I guess the answer is no. Yeah, no. I guess we have a actual mission we gotta do, huh? Alright, let's go all the way back around, since I guess I went the wrong way. Those are the stairs, I think. So let's just go around this way. And I think we're supposed to, if I remember correctly, I think we're supposed to go into the bathroom. Can I close this window? I guess not. That's what I, that's what I would have done. Wait, hold up. What's over here? Oh, I guess you could have just went this way. Oopsie! Alright, let's go over here. Creepy mask right there, dude. Is this it? Where we're supposed to be? Oh, right here. Wait, but first things first. Let's look around. I don't want to miss anything. Which I know I'm going to miss like 9 million things. But it's all good in the neighborhood. Alright, let's go into this door. Looks like there's nothing in the meantime. I just have to go straight in here and basically take off. I see a shiny right there, but... Oh god, dude, that sounds so creepy. There it is. What the hell, dude? So I'm not gonna lie, that still scared the hell out of me. I even knew what the hell was gonna happen. Perfect. We're freezing our buns off out here. The whole house is gonna catch fire. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'll, I'll be here all week. <laughs> <laughs> what is that, a Wolverine? Crap, that thing freaked me out. What was it? Are you okay? It was like a bear or a tiger or something. Oh, it was just a cute little baby Wolverine. Baby? Don't worry, buddy. You're gonna be a big boy soon. At least we finally got our way, we made our way inside. Home. How many are here? Four? Not the word five? I oh my gosh, it's so good to be inside. Yeah, five. It's still kind of freezing in here. I'll get a fire to go. This place barely looks any different. Yeah, nobody's been up here. Even with all the police coming in and out? N not a lot of action up here lately. Nope. What's up, party people? Hi. Seven now. Uh oh, SpaghettiOs. We'll do. Yeah. Come on in. Take a load off. Have whatever you want. You just take whatever you want anyway, right? Whoa. Easy there, cowboy. Uh... Let's challenge. What the hell were you doing with M out on the trail? What? I saw you and M. Through the telescope. Before? We just ran into each other. It's been a while, so we hugged and I said hello. Is that against the law? Well, he described it exactly what I saw. So logically, he might be telling the truth. Even though I don't trust him for it. So instead of instigating the situation, I'm just going to apologize and go with overreacting. I'm just going right. to keep an eye on him. Yeah. Duh. Sorry, it's been kind of a long day. I overreacted. Nah, man. Don't worry about it. Be cool. Yeah, yeah, totally. I'm not gonna lie to you. 
That's the first time I've ever done that. So that was interesting. But being alone together was uh oh my unnecessary. God, that is so gross. <laughs> Are you trying to swallow his face whole? Damn. I mean, seriously, can she be any more obvious? No one wants in on your territory, honey. Excuse me? Did you say something? Oh, did you not hear me? Was your sluttiness too loud? Sounds like <laughs> someone's bitter she didn't make the cut. Yeah, it's all a big cattle call with that dream boat. Congrats, you're top cow. Cuts real deep calling Miss Homecoming a cow. <laughs> uh, let's def try to defuse the situation. Em, come on. No, shut up, Matt. Stay out of it, you dumb oaf. Hey, watch it. Oh, you're the only one who can put him down? No one else can play with your toys? You're such a bitch. Whatever. I don't give a crap what you think. At least I can think. 4.0 bitch, on a roll. Suck on that when you're trying to sleep your way into a job. Who needs grades when you've got all the natural advantages you can handle? Oh, please. You couldn't buy a moldy loaf of bread with your skanky ass. <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> Do you think that's insulting? That bitch is on crack or something. Uh, let's just defuse it. Emily, stop. This is out of hand. And there's no reason to fight like this. Yeah, Em. Why are you picking fights over your ex-boyfriend? Huh? Damn, Jess, stop relax. It. This is not why we came up here. This is not helping. It's not what I wanted. If we can't get along for ten minutes, and maybe we need a little bit of a break, right? Mike, why don't you check out the guest cabin, the one I told you about? Yeah. Yeah, all right. Wanna go do that? Any place without that whore. Damn, she's right so the trail. aggressive. <laughs> Unfortunately, Matt's yeah. never gonna see or hear the end of this. So, Josh, uh, can we get this fire going? Where's my bag? Huh? My bag, the the little bag with the pink pattern, the one I got on Rodeo. Matt, are you are you listening? Oh my god, don't you remember next to the Italian shoe place where I got the stilettos and you knocked over the rack while you were drooling all over that girl at the counter? Well, I mean, she was asking about my letter jacket. Right, because she gave a shit about your designer letter jacket. <laughs> Why do you hate my jacket? Matt, I need my bag. Oh my god, Em, you, maybe you just forgot it. Do you seriously think I'd forget my bag? Well, Do I... you? Guess not. You must have left it down by the cable car station. <sighs> Come on, hon. We'll be back soon. And then we can get warm. You can get very warm. Okay. She's so dramatic. Okay. Like, my God. Okay, I'm gonna go take a bath. That's what I would do. Escape a little. Relax. Too much drama in this <sighs> common area. Cabin, anyway. This cabin is the coziest, the most romantic love den you will ever lay your eyes upon. <laughs> if we ever make it. I have a feeling <laughs> luck's on our side. Play your cards right, and maybe you will get lucky. Hey, porn stars! <laughs> porn star? I'd pay to see you. Uh, gross. I'm not surprised yeah, he would say that. Yeah. No worries, man. Oh, I'm sure you'll find a way to entertain yourself. Mm-hmm. You have fun with the peanut gallery. <laughs> oh, I almost forgot. I've got to fire up the generator so you can see where you're going. Will do, sir. All right. Roger that. I think Josh was flirting with me. Okay. You want to invite him up with us? <laughs> what? No. I hope she was kidding. Wasn't she just calling M the hoe and the slut and the skank and all this other stuff? Oh, Jess. You do not fail to surprise me. What are we looking at? Do I have to talk to you? Yes, I do. Hey, hot lips. Photo booth? All right, read my mind. Uh, all right, wait, hold on.
Ramadan. This is a little tough. Right? Uh, I'm trying to get them both equally. Will you guys stop freaking moving? Right? There. That's oh a pretty God. decent one. <laughs> this is perfect. We're like the cutest couple. Damn. You should be a model. You keep that camera handy, and maybe I'll let you start my portfolio at the cabin. Ooh. Noted. I guess we were going to have some uh, Jack and Rose situation over here. Hopefully their boat don't sink. Burr, it is freezing out here. Now that's something I can help you with. And how are you going to do that? Uh, I got a few things in mind. A nice warm shower. Oh wait, there's something right here. What is this? It's not a lot of TLC for this place anymore. Kinda Private bummer. property, Washington State estate. Alrighty, that's not helpful. But okay, sure, why not? There's uh, a lot of things hidden in this game. Sometimes you just have to like stop and look. Do we have to look at something again? Yes, we do. Emily's as dumb as she looks. If she thinks she can cut in on what we got going on. Maybe if we're lucky, she'll try and follow us out here and get eaten by a bear. Oh, relax. Just chill out. Uh, yeah, she's a handful. But maybe ease up on her. She's still kind of torn up from being dumb. Um, hello. Not my problem, Mike, and not yours either. Okay, I'm I don't like M, but no, I mean, she's getting hated not. on. I'm just saying it's like it's not worth kicking her when she's down. Cuz I'd much rather spend my time getting down with you. You see, you see what I <laughs> Yeah, okay. But she better stay down is all I'm saying. You guys should be working together, man. Like I don't know. There's no need for unnecessary hatred is all I'm saying. If we're gonna be up here, we might as well try to get along. What's this? Oh, it's another totem. Oh! She, <laughs> she got dropped, dude. What the hell? Danger. That was the creeper, huh? Punched her right in the freaking jaw. All right, Bone. come on, turn on, oh, baby. Let's go. There we go. I got the power. Thank you. Oh snap! It's the creeper. I'm surprised Jess didn't see it. He was just standing in the middle of the freaking window. Yay, we made it. Open, damn it. Why isn't it working? Kazam. There we go. The gates shall open. Kazam. Wasn't that a movie with Shaq? Or was that Shazam? Yeah. Totally I don't remember. Awesome. Oh yeah. I bring the hit. Whoop. <laughs> That's gonna get me demonetized. It's all good though. Do me a huge favor and drop a like on the video. And if you're not already subscribed, do that because that's probably gonna get me demonetized. Sexcapade, huh? I don't never heard that song before though. What's up? From Hannah and Beth. You'd think they'd clean it up. Well, they never closed the investigation. Okay, I'm getting the creeps now. Let's go with I hope they're at peace. Well, wherever they are, I'm sure they're happy we're all thinking about them. That's a nice way of thinking about it. That's kind of sad though, man. Not gonna lie. It's a full year and they still haven't found him.
I would hate to be in that situation, to be honest. If I was dead and... Oh, crap. What the hell was that? Did you hear that? I heard... Something. Yeah. Yeah, that was definitely creepy. But no, I would hate to be dead and then nobody knows what happened to me or where my body is or anything. That would suck. I don't think we can get her through the cabin with the path block like this. Oh, no way am I going back to the lodge, a.k.a. wax museum, to drink hot chocolate with that- Whoa! Ah! Jess! <laughs> That's what you get for being so hateful, Jess. Fuck! Hey, Jessica! Yep! Hey! I'm okay! Holy crap, you scared the heck out of me. How do you think I felt? Uh, you didn't hit your head or anything. As far as I can tell, I still have all seven of my limbs. <laughs> seven? Oh, yeah. Get out? I... I don't know. I can hardly see anything down here. Uh... Let's be heroic. I'm coming, Jess. Just stay put. Holy crap, there's creepers right there. He's... Hey, How did Jess not see him again? We move this cart thing? What do you think I'm here for? It looks heavy as hell, dude. Come on, use your upper body strength. Uh, oh, I'm pushing. I'm doing the wrong stick. My bad. I imagined us grunting together. <laughs> Not what I pictured. <laughs> that was funny. All right, where are we going, Jess? Being in this freaking abandoned mineshaft is extremely creepy. I wonder if they checked down here during the investigation. Ah! Oh! Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh, oh holy ah. crap! Ugh. Oh my gosh, are you okay? Uh, yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. I'm fine. He should have just got out of the way, trying to stop that big, heavy thing with all its momentum. Could have got him seriously hurt, dude, to be honest. Alright, let's, uh... Oh, Nelly. This place is getting let's check this way out first. Not the good kind of willies. What the hell's a good kind of willy? Comfort and reassurance. <laughs> we'll save it for the cabin buster. What is it? Oh, it's a totem. What is this? Was that Jess half naked? What the hell happened to her? Um What the hell was that? I'm so ready to get out of this cave. Get your ass over here, Jess, before we die down here. Fuck. Even these stairs are creepy. Looks like there's an opening right here. Let's explore. Is that a bullet? Oh, no. yeah, it's a stogie. Teresa. Wonder who's out there. Somebody's been chilling in here. I see this thing. Whoa. This place is like historical. Holy. Cave. He's gotta be Native American, right? That's creepy, dude. I don't think so. Whoa! You alright? Yeah. Close one. This place is falling apart. I don't think this place is up to code. Yeah, I'm thinking it's time to go. I'm thinking the same. Oh, I'm stuck. What's in here? Oh, there's something here. Uh, Jesus. areas at That's risk. A real fixer upper. The damn near the whole thing is destroyed. Let's see if there's anything. No, nothing else. I don't see nothing. Honestly, though, exploring is probably like the last thing we should be doing in here. Before the damn thing collapses on us and we just either A get trapped in here or die by some falling rubble. Finally, a little ray of hope. 
Hurry up, Jess. Woo, we're out of here. I hate that sound of crunching snow. Anything over here? Oh, wait. There's another path. Totem? Possibly? It is. What do we got here? I've never found this one before. Oh my god, dude. That's a dead Jess. I think we could potentially kill her. Not trying to do all that. Hopefully, and of course, this is a big hope. But, uh, I hope I'm able to keep everybody alive. Go! Jess, may I please proceed in front of you? You are walking way too slow. <laughs> Where do you see the Lincoln bedroom? Oh, are you planning on getting presidential on me? Oh man, they're very flirtatious. <laughs> alright, alright. Save for the stump speech, buddy. Ooh, a telescope. Gonna look at the trees, gonna look at the clouds, gonna look at the cabin. Um Whoa. What does she see? I just saw someone at the cabin. That's creepy. Holy fuck! That scared the shit out of me, dude. Alright, wait, what's this? Hey, Jess? Mm hmm? Stay close by, okay? What's that? There's uh, bears. This posting says there's some brown bears up here sometimes. Oh, Michael. I have the best idea. What? Let's go hug a bear. Come on. Please. Genius. Come on. Let's not hug a bear. No, go go down, Mike. What are you doing? Come on, baby. Can you please walk faster, Jess? It's too cold out here. I'm freezing. My jacket is not up to par for this situation. Oh look, it's a moose. Holy crap. Watch out, bird brain. I was just flirting. Just just answering his mating. Wow, you're easy. <laughs> Got a lot of love to give. I'm scared. <laughs> I was scared. <laughs> that was funny. Man, this is a long way to get to the cabin. Hold on, it's... before sending us up here? <laughs> really? What? I didn't figure you for the glass half-empty type. You got a better idea? Stand back, Debbie Downer. <laughs> oh, boo! Show off. Uh-oh. You've got something on your face. Boo! <laughs> <laughs> How did he fall for that one? Okay. okay. I mean, he saw her pick up the snow. That's how it's gonna be. Oh no. Yes. Yes. Oh snap. Jess is dead. Maybe. Sammy. What? Sammy well, Sosa. Get this fire going? Uh, well, I was just getting into the bath. Oh. Oh, well, do you need any help with that? <laughs> All right, yeah. He's a funny guy, I'll give him that. A little perverted, but he's funny. Come on. Let me guess, no hot water. 
All right, Josh, let's see if you know how to hook up the hot water in your big fancy lodge. Let's go. I'm assuming he's in like a... What the hell was that? a lot of very strange noises up here all right uh how do i go downstairs wait is this where i just came from what is this oh it's a bedroom wait what's this oh it's hannah's old bath uh bedroom uh, Joan D. Smith, tattoo artist. Okay, so she got a tattoo. Oh, yeah, that's her tattoo on her shoulder that they showed in the beginning. She got it March 18, 2013 at 9.30 a.m. Very nice. What's this one? Hannah, whatever her last name is, I'm assuming. Okay. Anything else? Oh, yep, there's something right here. Party, awesome party at seven. Gee, Hannah, crush much? Is that Mike? Oh, that's sad. That makes the prank a little bit more meaningful in the beginning. Yeah, right? Mostly C. Ah, so we were never compatible, apparently. Is that everything? I believe so. I don't see any more shinies. Hold on, let's check over here in this corner. Oh yeah, there, there's something right here. What is this? Hannah, Josh, and Beth, you are invited to Sam's Halloween party. Hey, it's my party. October 31st, 2013, fancy dress, obligatory. Hey, it's that picture that, uh, that psychiatrist dude showed us. That was interesting. Is that it? Alright, looks like it's done. Looks like she really liked butterflies. Let's go, Sam. We got stuff to take care of. And I can't go this way because it's closed. Oh, I'm stuck. There we go. What is with all what is with all these masks? Things are a joke, man. We don't do shit. No way, bro. I mean, we used to do it all the time, me and. Well. Josh, no hot water's kind of major oversight, don't you think? Yeah. Yeah, you just gotta fire up the boiler. It's in the basement. All right, you guys see if you can find the spirit board. Chris, let's go find it. It'll be like a scavenger hunt. Um. Okay. Guess so. Brad. Not gonna regret it. Yep, for a ride. I would not be messing with those. I'm not really superstitious or nothing, but some things you just don't want to mess around with. Just in case, you know? Ew, dude, that looks so creepy. Let's check it out. Oh, it's just some it's nothing. Uh go that way, Sam. What are you doing? And turn right here. Go down the stairs. It's about time, Sam. Damn. Nope. God, dude, the controls are so weird. All right. Are 
Are we in the basement already? You notice how I gave Chris and Ash a mission together? Yeah, I was thinking they could use some alone time. Subtle. Uh, all right. They are very sweet together. I wish they'd just freaking get on with it already. I swear, they just need, like, something to bond over. You know, some sort of traumatic event to send them into each other's arms. I mean, at this rate, they'll be in the geriatric ward before Chris makes a move. <laughs> <laughs> Seems a little sadistic, though, but wait, what's this? Oh, it's a family portrait. August 13th, Cape Cod, Josh with his lovely sisters, Hannah, Beth, looking great, guys. I should be following him, but... Oh, okay, never mind. I guess I can't go this way anyways. All right, I suppose I'll follow you, dude. I'm coming, I'm coming. Yeah, Sam. Yes, Josh? I just wanted to say... I love you. What? It really means a lot to me that everyone came back this year, and you know that you came, Sam. We're here for you. Josh... We're here for you. Really, whatever you need, whenever, we're all gonna make it through this. Together. Um, I want us to have a good time, you know? Well, I mean, that's nice. Oh, God, looks like we're going to an abandoned hospital. I think I can handle a little set of stairs. Mm -hmm. Maybe. Dude, this is creepy. How is this under the house? Or even a part of the property? This looks like a psychiatric hospital. Sorry to drag you down into the bowels. Oh, just get me some hot water and I'll be super fine. It's still going to take some time for it to warm up. Down here on your own, you know. Well, it's... Definitely creepy down here. To yep. say the least. Not a place to be on your own. Uh, what are we doing? Here, can you can you hold this? Yes, sir. Hold that. What was what? Just shine it here so I can see what I'm doing. That's so creepy, dude. Don't move. No! Hey, can you just keep the light so I can see, okay? Don't mess this up, Sam. Don't move. Oh my god, could this be any longer? Nice one. Woo! Okay, first things first. We gotta increase the water pressure before we get the boiler fired up. Mm, sounds kind of complicated. No, it's actually pretty simple. Is this all we need? All right. Ah, oh, damn. Was that? It's okay. I'm just try again. I think I was supposed to do it at a certain point. Now. Oh. That's more like it. <laughs> All right. Five, girl. Woohoo! Yeah. We did it. Does that mean I get to go take a nice hot bath now? What the hell is that sound? Ha <laughs> oh, you were really freaked out. Uh Let's go. Something's behind you. Oh my god. Don't move. What? Nothing behind you. Yeah, right. No, seriously. Ha 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 ha! 
<laughs> All right, your point. Dirty love. What? No. Well, you get the first point. Does it start at 30? No, 15. <laughs> <laughs> Oh snap. Okay, so you can pick another two, right? Josh. What? The rhythm is like weirdly regular. Not not nothing regular about it. Uh let's go check it out together. This this is not a time to be heroic. or some problem with the furnace. Unlikely. If it were me, I wouldn't want this place to burn down on my watch. Yeah, right. Oh, God. So creepy. Uh, holy ah! fuck! Oh, Run! Oh, oh, God. I'm waiting for all the buttons. Let's go! Come on, baby. No, come on. Why are these doors locked? To, to keep out strangers. Oh, hey. God. Uh, what? Hey. What the hell? Oh, you just got mumped. This guy's so what? creepy. <laughs> nice. nice one. That was good. Wait, but why would you do that? There's all this cool old movie crap down here. What was I? Was I not supposed to take advantage of the opportunity? Are you... Are you serious? Were you in on this, Putz? <laughs> no, but I, I wish I was. That was too good. That was scary. I'm ready to admit that your dumb little prank may have a slight whiff of humor. Joke master. Well, I, I said nothing about jokes. I said your prank, which was dumb. Holy crap, you were scared. Admit it. I was... Come on, you, you so were you, Josh. Josh. What in God's name are you wearing? <laughs> I found my true call. <laughs> Will you tell me you're going to take a vow of silence? <laughs> okay, okay. Did you at least find the thingy? Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. You know what? You know what? No, no. I've just... Been through enough spooking for one night, okay? I see a hot bath in my crystal ball. All right, so have fun. Oh, I want to see a crystal ball. That, Josh. He's a schemer. Okay. That was creepy. Oh, it's the analyst again. Nice to see you again. What the hell? What the hell's going on here? Why does it look different? like to understand your feelings toward people of fear the supernatural ghosts spirits and other intangible forces beyond the veil uh-huh do you share this fear no not really then how do you feel about people who are afraid teach his own i guess I mean, I feel sympathy, I suppose. I think, well, my oh my god, there's a spider on the table. Do you feel pity for him? No. Yeah. Indeed, that is apparent from the choices you made. What is he talking about? Oh, is he just trying to make this experience more sh scary, I suppose? What did you find, bro? And now, let us investigate your feelings toward other people in greater depth. What you value, what you respect in yourself and others. Which would you say was most important in a person, loyalty or honesty? Honestly, personally, I value both of them about the same. P probably, I'll probably go with honesty. So, 
You would tell the truth, even if it resulted in an unpleasant outcome for a friend. And what about honesty then, and charity? I definitely value honesty more than charity. <laughs> charity is overrated, I suppose. Better to be true to yourself than to help others in need, eh? Oh, no, I mean, not well, in that sense. Yeah. It's a little cynical that way, but... Out of time. We'll talk again soon. Whoa, dude, look at that freaking hook right there. But alright, guys. We're inching closer to an hour, so we're gonna definitely have to let it go right here, right now. By the looks of it, it looks like we're gonna be doing one full chapter of the game per video. So, that's probably where we're gonna leave it off from now on. Just do one chapter per video. Otherwise, it's either gonna be too long... Or, yeah, just too long period. So, with that being said, if you're enjoying this series, do me a huge favor. Drop a like on the video. Subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed because it really does help this channel grow. So, with that being said, catch you guys in the next video. Deuces.